What's going on gamers? Today we're going to be going over how to restore your server world backup. But before we get into the tutorial, don't forget to like this video, subscribe to the channel, and click that notification bell on so you can get notified when we post new tutorials just like this one. When running a Minecraft server, the most important part of your server is likely your world, as it holds all of your in-game progress. As a server owner, keeping this world safe should be one of your top priorities. That's why here at Apex, we've created a world backup and restore system. This backup system allows you to create backups of your world that can be restored at any time. This is especially useful if you run into any problems such as griefers, world corruption, or other world destroying problems. You can restore the backup simply from the Apex game panel, and we will be walking you through each step on how to do so. Don't forget folks that the backup system in this guide is only directed towards Minecraft Java Edition and does not work yet for Bedrock Edition saves. Our first step of course is going to be heading to the game panel and stopping our server before we make any changes. And once our server is stopped we can go ahead and head to the left of the page to the backup tab and then click. From here all you need to do is go to the top left corner of the page and make sure that you click on restore. And then once you're on the backup page right here, it's going to give you options. If you've backed up multiple times, it'll give you timestamps for each backup. We're going to go ahead and restore to the latest one because that's what we need to do. It's going to prompt you to make sure that you actually want to restore with your restoration. So go ahead and click OK to follow through and to get your world up and running. Once you've done that, it's going to prompt you to go ahead and jump into console to see log for details. Click on the name of your server at the top there, and it'll bring you back to the main Multicraft page. From here, jump into console, and then wait until restoring the backup says that it's done. It'll give you three lines or so, and once it's done so, you can go ahead and start the server back up, either by starting it or restarting the server. And once that's happened, folks, that's all you need to do to restore your backup. Sometimes your backup may still not get restored on the server. If your backup isn't restored when you connect to the server, it could be a variety of things causing the issue. Make sure that when you restore the backup that the server was offline. Also keep in mind that the backup system only holds two automatic backups at once and it will overwrite it each day. It may also be possible that you are too late in trying to restore the backup that you want to restore. Well folks, I hope this solves your issue. Thank you for watching this tutorial and thank you for using an Apex server. And as always, I hope you have lots of fun.